With this video, I'll show you how to effectively cut chain using an eye pin or a head pin. To start, take your length of wire, eye pin, head pin, whichever you choose, in your non-dominant hand. Here is my length of chain that I want all my other lengths of chain to be. Now instead of having to go through and count every single link, because you know you go blind after a while if you do that, the best thing to do is to take one of the end links on the chain and to slide it onto the eye pin, like so. Now the next step is to take the rest of your chain, locate the end of that, and then slip the end link of your length of chain onto the eye pin as well. Now you can do this one of two ways. You can hold this on the ground, and you can pull out your length of chain so that it lays nice and flat and straight, or you can hold it upright and then cut with your side cutters going perpendicular to the way that the chain is hanging. For video purposes, I'm going to do this with the chain laying down like so. Now, could you cut your chain effectively with having these two links far apart like this? After a while, sure. But if you're just starting out, it's always better just to saddle both lengths of chain up right next to each other. That way, you don't have to second guess and wonder, well, are you sure that's exactly right? Because we all know what a pain it is to cut one link short or one link too long. So when you're satisfied with where you know that your cut's going to be, take your side cutters and cut away. Now remember, always wear your safety glasses because little tiny links of broken chain will fly through the air if you're not pointing your side cutters down. Notice that I'm holding the flat part of my side cutters up towards me and not the indented side. If I hold my pliers down like this, any cut links should fall right onto my work surface like so. So this is how you effectively cut chain. So now when you look at your end result, you have two lengths of chain that are equal number of links, and you won't ever run into that problem of coming up short again when it comes to cutting chain.